Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel or welcome if you are new. I'm Aleandra and today we're building my dream greenhouse. Oh my god, the one in this picture looks amazing. This video was made possible by the EA Creator Network. They did give me codes for these two new kits for free. So thank you so much to them. So we have the Sims 4 Greenhouse Haven Kit. So this kit includes build items designed for creating the perfect greenhouse structure. Oh my God, I'm obsessed with the pictures. It looks so good. So we also have loads of tools, pots, plant starters, gloves, and spray bottles. Okay, I'm obsessed. Do we also have, yes we do, the basement treasures kit. I don't really know what to do with this kit. So if you have any ideas, comment down below. So basically we have some items that look a little scuffed up but they still have plenty of use and we have items that might have sentimental value stuff like their mom's favorite recliner or their grandparents old television so let me actually look at the items so greenhouse haven kit i keep forgetting what the name is so we do have new windows definitely we'll be using those Oh my god, these items are so cute. Obviously, there's not a huge amount and they are kits after all. I still am not a huge fan of kits. I miss stuff packs. But anyways, we will be building a greenhouse today. But let's take a look at the basement treasures kit as well. So you guys can let me know if you have any ideas. Obviously, like, this is the broken down, like, taken apart version of the heart bed from, like, Sims 2 or 3 or whatever. Why didn't we also get the bed? Um, oh my god, these oh these look so old. I don't know what to do with this. Literally have no idea. The plant looks cute. But yeah, comment down below if you do have ideas for this. Where should we build our greenhouse? I think I'm gonna do like a small one and then you can download it and put it in like your house's backyard or something. Should we do eco lifestyle? This is a tiny lot, so maybe we'll do it in there. We'll demolish it and we'll build our greenhouse. Wait, this is a horrible lot. What am I thinking? It looks so green all around here. Never mind. I want to go somewhere greener. Let's do Henford on Bagley and we'll pick. Should we do it up here <laughs> on top of the waterfall? Okay, now this is looking a lot more green, so let's get rid of this whole thing actually i should have used that there we go i looked at some pictures on google so i think i have like a general idea of what i want to do like i said i do want it to be kind of small it is like my dream greenhouse so i would like it to be big but we're not gonna do massive because i want it to be one that you can just put you know like i said in your backyard so i'm thinking of doing like an l shape kind of or maybe more like this. I don't know, we do need some space. Let's bring out this wall actually. I think that could work. And then what are the new windows like? So obviously they're these two. So they cover, okay, maybe I'll make it a little bit taller. Okay, let's see. So if we did these windows all around, I don't wanna do the green. I'm thinking black maybe oh my god stunning i was wondering where like all the little window panes were i don't know what to call these but they have the extra lines oh and this one that looks like it's like missing like there's no glass that's actually really really cool we'll use these i'm obsessed with those oh my god we need to do a door as well almost forgot should we put these like literally all the way around okay not in the corners I want to do like a double entrance, like you can enter from here and from here. I don't know why we're building over here. Maybe we should move this. There we go. It doesn't need to be all the way in the corner. Did we get new doors? <gasps> we did. Tall green view, double doors. Okay, perfect. I'm glad I took the taller wall height. So that can go there and we'll also put it over here. Beautiful. I know that... It doesn't look great right now, but I want to do like a brick at the bottom. I'm going to at least try it and see if it looks any good. But I do want to continue putting windows all the way around like that. I mean, it's a lot of windows, but greenhouses are literally just all windows, right? <laughs> Let's do the roof. I wish we could do a matching roof. I'm going to try my best, but it's, I don't know. This is where things might go wrong. <gasps> oh my God, they gave us glass roof. Okay. 
Okay, things are not gonna go wrong. Okay, I'm obsessed. I'm so happy they gave us that. Now if I can just fix this. Um, okay. What do I do with this part? I don't know how to fix that. Because if I just... That doesn't look right either. I could make part of the roof, like, not glass. What if I pull it all the way? Oh, that's not right. All the way through? Like that? Wait, that actually is not horrible. If you can't tell, I haven't built anything in a very long time. <laughs> I've only done a little bit of decorating, so it's gonna take me a little while to get back in the swing of things, but I did say I wanted to do, ooh, some brick. Should we do it up here as well? Because how do I make that glass? I'm actually happy with my first choice. Is there a way to hmm, get glass up there? Let me see. <laughs> oh my god, imagine putting solar panels here. I feel like it kind of defeats the purpose of having a glass roof, but it goes with the theme perfectly. <laughs> we could do wind turbines. <laughs> I was just trying to see what to do. I think I will leave this brick, and I did put the trim on the roof. I will probably put up some vines or something to make the outside nicer. Should we do like a path? Oh my god, we have a new, I don't know what to call this, a new floor tile. <laughs> and we have a bunch of different colors. Wait, which color do I think will go with this the best? I want to do like the brown vibe with the black, but this is more of like orangey red terracotta. So I think I'll just do the first swatch. I think that's good. We'll probably do that on the inside as well. Okay, cute. I'll do a little seating area out here. I'm just gonna decorate the outside a little bit before we get to the inside, just using a bunch of vines and whatever I can find, stuff like this. I feel like I want it to look like a little bit older, like it's been here a while. Stuff has started to grow all over it. Okay, so I've taken the wisteria from Cottage Living and I've put it all around the greenhouse. I'm kind of obsessed with it. I feel like it looks really good and overgrown. I think that was the word I was looking for earlier. I think it's stunning. I'm not sure about the roof situation, but I think we're just gonna roll with it. The Sims has its limitations and I can't have the perfect joining of these two roofs, that's fine. I think I'm gonna pull out all the items from the kit, just put them to the side so that then I can just pull them from there and make sure I use most of them, if not all of them. I don't think any of these have the right icon, but we could use stuff from the plant pack as well. Don't ask me what it's called, I have no idea. Oh yeah. Okay, so they're still marked as new, so perfect. We have that little sprout icon, I guess. What is this? The gardener's stand. I'm assuming this just has a bunch of slots on it, yeah. I don't think it's functional apart from that. Oh my god, look at the little seedlings. Okay, this is gonna be fun. Ooh, the air cycler. Give your plants the air they crave. It brings fresh air into your greenhouse. Can we fit this inside somewhere? I was thinking of putting it on that wall up there. Oh yeah, okay. We can do that. Can you see it from the outside as well? Oh, you can, okay. It's not pretty, but it's not the ugliest thing I've seen. What is this? This ventilation grate will be the crowning touch to your greenhouse. Wait, 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 what is this? Is this, what is this? <laughs> I don't know what this is. Where do we put it? Because my rooms are tall. Interesting. Okay, I think that is all of the new items. The rest of these marked ones are from basement, whatever it was called, I forgot already. Should we use this plant though? That came from the basement pack. I'm not trying to use just one pack, obviously, as I already used Cottage Living. Do we hate how the windows look? I don't think they look that bad. Like, I like that you can see the brick here. Obviously, the door being longer. Hmm, could I? I don't know how I would do anything about that. Personally, I don't mind it. I think it looks cute. Let me see if I can get a really cute outdoor table set up out here. 
before we move on to the inside, I don't think I want to do a bench. I think I want to do like a proper table, like a round one, something like this maybe, or I don't know, what kind of vibe are we going for? I quite like this and it definitely matches the rest of the furnishings, maybe we'll do the black and then I need chairs. Okay, I think this is cute, this table with these chairs, but there's a lot more space. So I wanna kind of do like a fountain or something in here, but I haven't built anything in so long. I don't remember everything that we have. I might just pull out some items that I think I would use in here. But yeah, I don't have like an instant idea of what to put there. Like, should we do one of these statues i don't hate it but i definitely feel like it's a little bit out of place oh what about her she's cooler that's not a fountain though which is kind of what i was talking about oh my god does she have purple flowers in any of these oh that's close it's kind of cute kind of random as well okay now this fountain full of flowers i feel like that could be it I kind of like it. I feel like it does its purpose. We'll put this fountain here. I move the table to the side. Oh, and we do have like this new thing from the pack. Is there anywhere where I could put this? Yeah, maybe. I don't know where to put this. So I'm gonna sell it for now. We'll probably put some pots and stuff outside, but let's move indoors. I realized this kit does come with a shelf and is it down to put it? where you have a glass. I feel like it is. Should we get rid of just a couple of windows so we can have at least a couple of shelves? Like maybe these two in the middle. Oh yeah, I haven't put wallpaper <laughs> indoors. Should probably do that. The lighting is crazy in here. I know it's gonna be stunning in game, but right now as I'm building, it's a little bit crazy. Can I? I mean, we could build in nighttime. Oh my god, stunning. We do have a light as well. I was gonna say a ceiling light, it's not gonna work, but it's not a ceiling light, it's a wall light. And actually that will be perfect. Let's bring some light in here. This lighting is absolutely stunning. So what do we wanna do inside? Definitely some planters. Like there's no new actual planters with this kit, which I don't know, interesting. What do you call this? So this is just a table. We obviously do need some storage space. So we'll use at least one of these. Oh my God, I love it. It doesn't cover up the windows. We could put one right below the shelves. And then I do wanna use this unit, which is so cute. We could use a couple of these. Honestly, the lighting is driving me crazy. I can't tell what colors I wanna use. Do we wanna go like dark wood or medium wood and what's gonna match? I cannot tell. Like, does that tile, it looks so much darker inside. And then I made these shelves black. I don't know what I'm doing. This shelving though would be amazing, but I don't have any wall space. Let's go back to outdoors and outdoor activities. And then we'll pull out some of the planter boxes. I mean, we could have them like in the middle and then you walk around. But I feel like, I feel like a lot of greenhouses you'd have like, you know like the sides like this and then also one like in the middle and then there's two hallways that you could like walk through but there's not enough space oh my god i forgot about the vertical gardens as well wait these could be perfect in the middle like backs together or do i mind if they cover up the windows maybe i don't we will do the flower arranging table as well, but I really need to put some planters in here. We need some plants, like actual plants. I think planters and then like plants that are like in the plants category. <laughs> okay, which planter is nicer? The original one or the werewolves one? I didn't even know we got a planter from there. You can tell, haven't built in a while. Did this always have this many swatches or has that been updated at some point as well? I like both of them. This one's like a bit more rustic. Oh my god, and then we have... <gasps> I think I would put this like outside, but today we're focusing on the actual greenhouse. Maybe I'll grab these and just see if there's any good placement. I wish you could put the small planters like on the table. I feel like that would be cool. 
Okay, I think I've actually settled on the round little planters. I think it makes more sense in this small space. I'm sorry about the lighting. I really don't know which lighting I want to use. Now let's make sure we use the rest of these items as well. Oh, that only goes in the middle, really? Well, we can just fix that like so. There we go, perfect. Okay, these planters are adorable. There's different versions, like these ones are empty. And then there's a couple different colors for the actual plant. I am obsessed. Okay, I'm just using the little decorations, making sure I put them everywhere. So we have the little pots and the spray bottles. And then over here we have these little, what are these called? Seed pots. So I put those around, we have more pots. It's starting to look cute. It definitely needs more actual greenery. Oh, and we do have these bigger pots still that I haven't used. I did want to put some like outside because there are so many color options. These are so pretty. Okay, now I'm looking for plants to put in here. Okay, I've gone through the entire plant category and I've added a lot of plants. Um, a lot of ones I've never used before. Again, haven't built in ages. I needed to use this plant. It's originally even bigger than this, but it is beautiful. It's like a um, banana leaf, banana tree, right? Absolutely stunning. And then I've added some more plants up here on the shelves. We have this one, which I thought was cool. And then in this corner, we do have the new plant from the basement kit and this adorable little decoration thing. And then we have some baskets over here. We have more plants over here. There's a lot. And then even more in this corner. I don't know if you can reach this planter, but it's whatever. You can at least reach this one and this one and then there's two here and one here so five or six plants it's not that many but a lot of it is decorational i would definitely do like an outdoor garden area either for like the big vegetables from cottage living or just more planters outside maybe even do like a cool roof thing over them let's see in some other lighting I'm not doing rugs, obviously, or like anything on the floor. Should we put some of these planters back here? I feel like maybe we should, just to add a little bit of more planting space, like actual space. So maybe I can make some spots for them like this. Like, I think that's cute. I made this too big. But like that, and then obviously move that a little bit. That was really cute. I forget what pack that's from, but I thought it would go there perfectly. Yeah, add some little more space. I know it's not really part of the greenhouse. Maybe we'll throw these pumpkins out here. I don't know, just a little bit of something. Okay, I think we're done. I feel like I have forgotten something very much possible, but I think it's looking cute. It's a little bit taller. The most greenhouses i feel like i use them medium wall height but i love the new windows stunning this is the new roof as well we have a little seating area out here wait a minute we need to put a plant right there might as well use the new plant from the pack have they removed the function like if you click the same category that you're in this like disappears so the ui isn't taking such a big part of your screen i'm like I want this to go away, but it won't. Either way, we have the little outside area. Oh yeah, I even put some more plants here. A little seating area. It's really cute. We have some more planters out here. A little bit more decorations. The wisteria going all the way around. And then when you come inside, I love it. I will show you guys screenshots. But first, yeah, we have the flower arranging table. We have the vertical planter, which I forgot that gives you even more space to plant things. But apart from that, it's mostly decorational, just a couple of plant pots. I feel like a greenhouse can get really hot, so I don't know how many like workstations you would want to have inside the greenhouse anyway. I wish I could put like a tap somewhere so that you can get water. I just thought of that now. One of these sinks or something? Where would I shove that? Maybe even outside. Maybe I'll actually put it in this corner. I took away one of the plants. I mean, in The Sims, you don't need to get water from, you know, a water source to water your plants, but for realism, we'll put that there. And yeah, I am obsessed. I will show you the screenshots now. 
Let me know what you think. What else would you have added? Do you think the size is good? Should there be more planters inside? Because I feel like that's what the greenhouse is for. But you can also have the decorative plants in the Sims. So why not? I haven't built anything in a long time, like I said. So this was my first build in a month. So let me know how you think I did. And give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Let me know what you think of the new kits and what should I build with the basement kits? Because I have no idea. If you want to download this, I will be putting it on the gallery. My gallery ID is YT. You can also look for it under the hashtag Eliandra. Anyways, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!